Did the U.S. Department of Defense invent the internet? How's it going? Welcome back to Standard Issue, where you have all the answers to your standard military questions and topics, including whether it's true that the U.S. military actually created the internet. Well, this is mostly a myth, but like many myths, it's grounded in some truth. In the late 1960s, the U.S. Department of Defense funded ARPA and the ARPANET. This is the network that is the cause for the myth of the U.S. Department of Defense creating the internet, even though if you look at ARPANET, it resembles nothing which we have today. ARPA stands for Advanced Research Projects Agency, and the NET obviously stands for Network. And like the name kind of implies, it was a network meant for scientific research that linked multiple universities and places of research together. So ARPANET might not be the very first internet, but it is definitely one of the very first networks. But it wouldn't be the only network for long. Shortly after the continued growth of ARPANET in the 1970s, Robert Kahn and Benton Cerf invented the Transmission Control Protocol and the Internet Protocol. This invention allowed multiple networks to talk to each other, but the Internet still didn't look like as we know it today. That would come a little bit later in the 1990s. Shortly after the decommission of ARPANET, a computer scientist with CERN, Tim Berners-Lee, would invent the World Wide Web. And you can argue about semantics and what the Internet is and is not. Most people, when they think about the Internet, though, do think about the World Wide Web, and that is how most people access the internet information. But you can also go with a more technical definition of the internet, of interconnected computer networks, which the TCP IP would probably be the first with Robert Kahn and Benton Cerf's invention. So it really depends on what you consider the internet, technical or what you actually use in reality. But either way, the U.S. Department of Defense did not create the internet as we know. But they created a great stepping stone to get there. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please go ahead and subscribe. And join us every Tuesday at 2 p.m. for more videos. But until then, stand at ease.